not to take it up, I think, would be a big mistake. Um, you can look around. Applause from the gallery after Democratic Assembly Minority Leader Gordon Hintz criticized Republicans for not debating gun law proposals. We need to try to keep firearms out of the hands or reduce the easy access of those who are of harm to themselves or to others. And that's why the governor put these things forward. The Democratic bills would mandate universal background checks and create a so-called red flag law that would allow family members or police to ask judges to temporarily seize firearms from people who pose a threat. Before the regular session started, Republican Speaker Robin Voss doubled down that they would gavel in and gavel out of the special session on guns. We already know where people stand. I, I don't necessarily want to spend a bunch of time playing politics with this, which is what it seems like my Democratic colleagues really want. Voss said there are already Wisconsin laws that allow guns to be taken away. Even when you yell fire in a crowded theater, it happens first, then you're prosecuted after. What they want to have happen is that you're prosecuted first and you have to prove yourself innocent. That is just a basic idea that far too many of us cannot accept. Terry joining us live once again. Now, Terry, we've seen the assembly. What about the Senate? A spokesperson for Senate Majority Leader Scott Fitzgerald told me that they plan to gavel in and gavel out later tonight, Toya. All right, Terry, thank you. And earlier today, activists stood outside the Capitol calling for a vote on what they called life-saving gun violence proposals. They cited a recent Marquette Law School poll that found 80% of Wisconsin voters support background checks on all gun sales and 81% support extreme risk protection orders. And they bring out false excuse after false excuse for not moving this legislation forward. Well, if they're so proud of it, then why not hold a debate? Yeah. That's right. Why not hold a vote? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Come on, fellas. If you're so proud, put it on the record. And of course, we'll stay on top of what's happening in Madison. We